What's up everybody, it's True Flocka back at it again with another Madden YouTube video. Today we're going to be doing a special video. Everybody knows Trace McSorley is for some reason trending. I have no clue. He's trending on TikTok, Twitter, everywhere. He even just came out with merch. A third string quarterback just came out with merch. But anyways, I have his exact height, exact weight here. I changed the name to Trace McSorley. I got his number seven. I got him in the Ravens uniform. About as best as I can get him to look. I don't. Really, there's not really any black cleats in the game to kind of, and except for those. Uh, they have the orange swoosh on them. It's not that big of a deal. But this is the best I can get him to look. We're probably gonna be playing with the Lamar Jackson build, the trust build, only because it's probably the only one that can kind of relate to him. He is kind of a scrambling type quarterback with not the best of arm. But anyways, let's head right into a game and let's see what he could do. Hey. First off, before we head into the gameplay, I'm going to show you my build, actually. We're going to be running pocket dead on him so we can get a little bit of better throwing for the truss. The truss's throwing is not terrible, but pocket dead eye just makes it literally insanely perfect. That's why I throw it on him. And then we got a jukebox on here. This is probably the most realistic build you're going to get from him. I don't think, obviously, jukebox is the best build for him, but comparing him to these other ones, it's probably is the best. Actually, to make it a little more realistic, I'm going to change jukebox to escape artist. Because Trace McSorley for sure doesn't have jukebox-like moves in real life. Let's head right into the gameplay. Alright, so we are going to be taking him on with a scrambling quarterback. We got Trace McSorley here versus a possession receiver, the Michael Thomas build. He is level 2 only, so he is wearing the basic uniform too. It might be a new player, but we are on the Bo Jackson field. Uh, this is probably my favorite one, only because there's no bad players you could choose from to put on your team on here. There's no low overalls. Everybody's basically the same caliber. But anyways, let's see. If, so he's playing deep zone. We're going to have to chuck it down a little bit here. As Trace McSorley gets in the open field. Let's see if Trace McSorley could take this all the way. No way. I know this isn't the most realistic. But if you watch college highlights of Trace McSorley, he does have a lot of big runs. A lot. I mean a lot of big runs. At Penn State, he used to go off. He was one of the best quarterbacks in the nation. If you can ask anybody this, this is why everybody knows his name. Let's see if we can get a throwing play to him, though. We do have him lefty. I do not know why. This is a glitch because it says righty everywhere, but it still shows lefty. I don't know, know why. I've switched it many times back. It just does not want me to play righty at all. But anyways, as we're on defense there, we did make a clean little post right there on the three-point conversion. Let's see if we can get a stop here with Trace McSorley. I think he just threw a pick there. Yes, he did. This one looks like it's going to be a fast one. We'll try to get tackled back here so we can get Trace McSorley the ball back. I want to get him a couple more throws. He is very... Well, the trust build with Pocket Dead Eye is almost unstoppable. I know a lot of people don't like using trust anymore because of like the fumbling and stuff that's been happening. But it hasn't been terrible. So we're going to try to try to bait here. We're trying to get Trace McSorley the ball every time. We're just going to throw it to Y here. We're going to try to get... Oh! Oh, as we get killed there. I was going to try to spin around him, try to get Trace McSorley behind me so I can get him a nice little pass. But anyways, let's see if we could force him the ball here on a post route to Richard Sherman. I want to get some more throwing with him. I think this is a cover two. I think he's going to be wide open if I angle it up, as we will. That is a dot by Trace McSorley. That's the pocket dead eye right there. Like, normally a trust, the trust would, like, it would be, like, a kind of a lobby throw because it would be out of range for trust. But with the pocket dead eye, it makes it, like, a beautiful throw. It makes trust a little more playable, if you if you don't mind me saying that. But anyways, let's see if we can get a... I want him to rush. He hasn't rushed once yet. So we're going to try to hit tr trust here. Or, uh, ooh, we're trying to hit... Trace McSorley's wide open in the back of the end zone. As he gets a nice toe tapper in the back of the end zone. It is 25-0. to 0. I will not be surprised if he quits here. This one has been a complete blowout. But it's he is new. He is new to the mode. It is a little difficult at first. But anyways, let's get back to defense. I want Trace McSorley to get a, uh, a turnover here. That would be insane. We're going to try to bait here. I think he's going to catch that. Odell makes a crazy, like, he wasn't even looking at the ball. Catches That's like, that is a crazy animation. Probably the most unrealistic because there's no way in hell someone's going to catch the ball not looking with one hand and, may, and like, pose in midair like that. But let's see. I want, I want him to force the ball downfield so we can get a McSorley pick as he's going to be throwing that i think oh he has jarvis i thought jarvis was on my team 
But that Jarvis almost made a crazy sideline catch over there for him. Let me know another thing. What videos you guys want me to like? You guys want me to do? I could do offensive tips. I could do uh, basically anything when it comes to the yard. I am still trying to get into ultimate team a little more, but it's a little harder to compete in ultimate team until I get farther. If you know what I mean. So I've been sticking to the yard. The yard has been fun for me. The only thing that sucks is obviously the content. There's been no content updates. Whereas we're playing great defense right here. We have not. Where he's not even moving the ball the last three snaps. See so if we can get another stop here. I want I want to get a pick here, but it doesn't look like we are. AJ Green just like literally takes on the whole team. I think he's probably gonna go quit here, sadly, because I do want to play a little more with him. But anyways, this has been the Trace McSorley build. The reason why I'm not doing another game is because there has been nobody playing the yard lately. It's so hard to find games sometimes on here. It's like I'll sit here and just search and search and search. But anyways, this has been Chew Flock. I hope you guys enjoyed this video on Trace McSorley, the little special we got going. But anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.